Hi, I'm Tristan McCauley from Lucky 7 Tattoo, and I'm here to tell you a little bit about ear globe stretching repair. In the case of a blowout, which is basically uh, pressure that's built up on the inside of the gauge, and it just pushes the flesh out from behind, you have a few options. You can go to a smaller gauge, say for instance, if he's blown out, you just want to go one step down, and that'll help heal it up a little, bit, a little better. It'll let, help the blood flow a little more, which in turn will help the healing progress a little bit faster. Another thing you can do is pop your earring out through the back and then pop it right back in the other way and that'll tuck that blow out underneath. Uh, it's not as effective as if you were to put in a smaller gauge but it does the job until you can put something else in there. Um, another thing I want to talk about is stretching past a certain point you may not be able to go back to your normal size ear. Um, some people say it's two gauge. My best bet is to say it's double zero, to, uh, from my experience. Um, past a certain point, you will have to have plastic surgery to put it back together. What they'll do is they'll cut the lobe at the bottom, take out whatever section they need to to get it back to normal, and then sew it back together. It's not very affordable, it's pretty expensive, but that's the option you have. So think really well, really hard, if you make sure that's what you want to do before you try to do it, because past a certain point, that is your only option. And that is how to repair a stretched ear.